Hi, my name is Matthew Sam, and I was wondering what happens if we run Windows 10 Mobile on a PC. Now, how do we do this? If we install Visual Studio and on Windows, we can we get an option to install Window, the Windows 10 Mobile SDK, which is a software development kit we use to develop and debug apps without needing to, to use the actual an actual Windows 10 mobile phone. We, we can debug apps in place on our PC in an individual studio emulator. Now, along with that SDK, we also get a file, an image file. It's not a, a viewable image, it's an image that is meant to be booted from so that it, it runs full Windows 10 mobile in the emulator. But that same image, whose link I will leave in the description, can be used to be booted from on, an, on a normal PC. So I flashed that image onto my SSD. This is a 60 gigabyte SSD. All, all you need is actually two gigabytes because Windows 10 mobile is very small as an operating system. I used WinImage to do this. I leave a link on how you can flash an image using WinImage here. And I will try to boot from this on my laptop and we'll see what happens, right? All right, so let's boot and see what happens. starts off just like Windows 10. Alright, so we, we've got Windows 10 Mobile. Now, can we control it this time? Yes, mouse is supported. Let me bring a mouse because the trackpad is slow. All right, so what can we do here? I'll try to play some music. I put some, I put a song there. Does it play? No, no, there is no song. But at least Groove Music opened as if we're on Windows 10. How do I close? Alt F4. So Alt F4 works. Settings. Let's see settings. settings. Weakness level. Huh. The same as if we're on Windows 10. But I presume some set, some settings don't work, such as the devices, for example, because we don't seem to have any drivers. We, we can't we can't even can we access the internet? Open Microsoft Edge. No, it doesn't even have network drivers. Can we view photos at least? Yes, all right, all right. We can at least view photos. Files, what, what files are we? So it's the same as if we're on Windows 10 Mobile right here. Up, maybe? No, no. Calculator <laughs> 90 
excellent from sleep. Nine plus ten. Camera. Yes. <laughs> what? What is this? What? What the hell? <laughs> well, that's random. Cortana. Hey, Cortana. Hey, Cortana. I didn't get the bandwidth I needed. Try again shortly. All right. <laughs> I don't think it can do anything because we're not connected to the internet. How do we go back? To the start menu. Uh, mm, escape for Alt F4. Yes, yeah, sorry, Alt F4 takes you back to the start menu. Microsoft Word. Skip for now. We can't sign in because. No internet. <laughs> this is going to be a recurring thing. Maps. Let's go. You've got my permission. No, we can't. We can't either because no network and because probably. It doesn't even have the lo loca the drivers of the location sensor on my laptop. If I press the power button, oh, so the song is theoretically still playing. Of course, no sound drivers. Oh, it, it just takes you to the lock screen. All right, I think that was that was a quick tour of Windows 10 mobile on uh, on a PC. I think I'll be formatting this SSD because right now it's a pretty useless operating system. <laughs> I just replace it with Windows 10. All right, thanks for joining me. I'll see you next time.